Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. So in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys a DIY hair rinse that can help with hair growth. If you're interested in this video, then please stay tuned. So the first ingredient that you're going to need is going to be one tablespoon of aloe vera powder. Aloe vera contains vitamins A, C, and E. All three of these vitamins contribute to cell turnover and promoting healthier cell growth. If your hair follicles are blocked with excessive sebum, dirt, or dead skin, they won't be able to grow properly. Aloe vera can also help cleanse the scalp so more nutrients can penetrate the hair follicles, helping hair to grow faster and more efficiently. The next ingredient is going to be two tablespoons of Irish sea moss gel. So when it comes to Irish sea moss gel, it helps to promote hair growth by stimulating slow producing hair follicles. Also, sea moss is a rich source of iron, vitamins E, and 92 minerals that are vital to maintaining healthy hair growth. Also, it helps to hydrate the scalp and it also helps to restore bald spots, thinning edges, soothes an itchy scalp, and helps with dandruff. So now I'm just going to take all the ingredients and place them into a mason jar with one cup of hot water. So after about 20 to 25 minutes, I allowed the rinse to cool down. So now I'm just going to strain it. And then I'm gonna take the tea rinse and place it into a spray bottle for easier application. Now, when it comes to storage, you want to place it into the refrigerator when not in use, and it should last about two to four weeks. And if you want it to last longer, you can place it into the freezer and it should last about three to six months. So when using this as a hair rinse, you want to apply this all over your hair and scalp after you shampooed your hair because you want to make sure that your scalp is clean. Once you've sprayed it all over your hair and scalp, you're just going to leave it on your hair for about 30 minutes and then you're going to rinse it out and then you're going to follow up with your favorite deep conditioner. So you can do this method whenever it's your wash day. So whether you wash your hair once a week or every two weeks, so it'll just be up to you. So that's how often you should use the rinse whenever it's your wash day. Thank you. 
Also, you can use this spray as a leave-in. If you want to use it as a leave-in, um, you can use it two to three times a week. All you have to do is just apply it on your scalp and also all over your hair from root to ends and then make sure you follow up with your favorite hair oil or hair butter or cream so that way you can seal in the moisture thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this video don't forget to like share comment and subscribe and i will see you guys in my next video bye